The James Webb Space Telescope has made a finding in the endless reaches of the universe that will destroy our knowledge of the cosmos. This new finding reveals a black hole that has the potential to destroy our universe. Mikio Kaku, a world-renowned astrophysicist, expressed his interest in this discovery. For the first time, we observe the true beginning of the cosmos. Personally, I think we're actually looking at monstrous black holes where maybe new laws of physics are coming to light, says Michio Kaku, and if you can figure it all out, you might be in line for a Nobel Prize. Michio Kaku is one of the first scientists to speak openly about what James Webb truly observed at the edge of time. Enormous black holes, an image of ancient galaxies that should not even exist has shocked astronomers and cosmologists. In addition to this surprise, it has now been shown that at least one of these galaxies contains an ultra-massive black hole. This discovery has the potential to permanently alter our understanding of the universe. As a result, it earned the moniker Universe Breaker. Would you have predicted that the photos from the new telescope would shatter all previous records? Physics stands in the face of increasingly more intractable puzzles. Researchers had hoped that the new space telescope would reveal answers or finally prove ancient theories such as the Big Bang ever since the first images were released. Everything was still fantastic at first. NASA released a photo of several stars and a large number of galaxies. The older the galaxies mature, the more reddish and darker they become. The quest began after the image was published. Dozens of research teams from all across the world set out to examine the photograph. Modern technologies extract enormous data from every point of light in the photograph. Researchers are using specific computer technology to determine how old the light is, what components reflected the light, how fast this galaxy was moving, and how many stars it most likely contained. The James Webb Space Telescope is a modern technological marvel that, with photos like this one, transports us to a moment only half a billion years after the Big Bang. Researchers were soon able to reveal the first discovery of ancient galaxies, as well as the discovery of a gigantic black hole 10 million times the mass of our Sun. But how could such a large object exist at such a young age in the universe? A black hole of this size so soon after the cosmic Big Bang upends every existing understanding of galaxy formation. Consider that, according to the previous Big Bang theory, there should only have been first prototypes of stars and star collections at that period. However, we are currently gazing at six enormous, luminous, and star-filled galaxies. All of these galaxies may have supermassive black holes at their cores. Black holes are revealed by gravitational lensing. In the expanse of space, it is difficult to view black holes and distant objects. Because we can't see them, we may be missing out on many of the oldest galaxies and black holes. Despite considerably improved technology, scientists continue to hope for gravitational lensing. This effect should reveal even more ancient and larger black holes, rounding out our picture of the early cosmos. Gravitational lensing was found by chance when scientists noted odd visual distortions. Massive objects, such as galaxies or black holes, cause gravitational lensing. The gravitational pull of very large items upstream magnifies little and distant objects in the background of an image. In recent years, this simple yet profound cosmic coincidence has greatly aided researchers in identifying faraway galaxies and exoplanets that would not have been visible otherwise. Researchers want to exploit this technique's ability to look further and further back in time, eventually solving the enigma of the early cosmos. Have you been startled by the discoveries of black holes and extraterrestrial intelligences? Then wait because scientists revealed two more astonishing findings about black holes at the beginning of 2023. 
The first discovery indicates that something large and unknown is being pulled into our galaxy's black hole. The second breakthrough is that advanced alien civilizations use black holes as quantum computers. These two discoveries were discovered relatively near together and may be related. Researchers discovered the mystery object at the core of our galaxy shortly before the publication of a paper on aliens and quantum computers. Is there a relationship here? Many of you probably see some amusing alien sitting in front of a black hole surfing the internet when you think of aliens and quantum computers. However, this is not the intended application of quantum computing. However, scientists have concluded that if you could get close to black holes without being deconstructed into their component bits, they would be brilliant quantum computers. According to the study, advanced civilizations may tap into black holes or employ miniature black holes manufactured in the laboratory as knowledge warehouses and data processing devices. Such machines' capabilities would be far beyond our imagination. One in one somehow came together, and for days, wild stories flew that the item that had recently appeared near the black hole in the center of the Milky Way was an alien spaceship in quantum computing. Unfortunately, this expectation was quickly dashed. We'd probably all be pleased with the first image of a spaceship in the center of the galaxy. However, the unusual object with the brief scientific designation X7 was later shown to be a vast cloud of dust and gas. Astronomers discovered that X7 is roughly 50 times the mass of the Earth and was already severely stretched by its proximity to the black giant in the spring of 2023. The cloud size has increased to 3,000 astronomical units or 3,000 times the distance between the Sun and us. Astronomers were perplexed for a long time as to where X7 had come from. A cloud this large is a unique sight. Most likely, X7 is a relic of a star mission that is currently on its way to being pulled into the Milky Way's black hole. X7 will orbit the black hole several more times during the next 70 years. The cloud will be so near to the event horizon in 2036 that there will be no escape. When the massive cloud ultimately evaporates in the core of the galaxy, the black hole will flash brilliantly for some time, making it visible. Unfortunately, we don't know if aliens will be present and use the forces to their advantage. According to some cosmologists, organisms capable of harnessing black holes as energy sources or computers may be invisible. They may have turned into pure energy, allowing them to approach dark giants without being ripped apart. Since Albert Einstein predicted the existence of black holes in his theory of general relativity, scientists have been fascinated by the cosmic giants. They are extreme gravity locations where the laws of physics are changed in ways we do not completely comprehend. Their function in the universe is similarly unknown. The James Webb Space Telescope not only detected the oldest black hole, but it also revealed fresh details about the nature of these cosmic monsters. It has revealed that black holes were significantly more abundant and big in the early cosmos than previously imagined. Researchers previously considered that black holes originated when enormous stars fell and collapsed in on themselves at the end of their lives. As a result, gravitational forces become limitless at a point in space. However, the discoveries made by the James Webb Telescope do not fully fit the scenario. The galaxies would be much older and must have existed prior to the Big Bang. There are now only two possibilities. Our universe is actually older than previously assumed, or black holes develop in a radically different method than previously imagined. The six galaxies discovered by the James Webb Space Telescope are a testament to the universe's diversity and complexity. They also force us to reconsider our understanding of the universe's black giants. The splendor of the universe is breathtaking, with large areas of it resembling a multicolored cosmic dance. However, creatures such as black holes or horror stars that devour others exist.
These and other discoveries frequently push our thoughts to their limits. If these black holes in the galaxy's centers were originally dead stars that grew to tremendous size by sucking in matter or merging with one another, it would have taken millions or billions of years for them to grow to this scale. Please keep in mind that the galaxies observed existed 13.6 billion years ago. The Big Bang is thought to have occurred 200 million years earlier. You've undoubtedly realized that the math no longer applies here, and we must entirely modify our understanding of black holes, star creation, and galaxy development. The explanatory techniques are little more than wild speculation. According to prior theories, the first stars in the cosmos were massive, luminous, and brief. Following their explosion, they may have left behind equally massive black holes, stimulating star formation in their neighborhood and possibly producing turbo galaxies. The presence of supermassive black holes in the centers of galaxies has significant consequences for their development and evolution. Their huge gravitational attraction can drag stars and gas into the arms of the galaxy, forming new stars while also expanding the galaxy. The strong jets and winds released from the black hole's accretion disk can heat up the surrounding plasma and restrict star formation. Black holes shape and construct huge galaxies through their activity. As a result, they are not only terrible and all-consuming, but they also serve as a vital structuring variable in the cosmos. According to one recent idea, dense regions in the early cosmos gave rise to several black holes, which eventually merged and grew to huge sizes. Another theory suggests that these black holes grew to be millions of times the size of our sun due to the rapid consumption of gas and stars in their neighborhood. There are some hypothetical notions that suggest that conditions existed in the early minutes following the Big Bang that permitted supermassive black holes to originate immediately without going through the star evolution process. Which of the following statements is correct? Time will tell, as will ever-improving photographs of the universe. Subscribe now and never miss another great video again.